Well, I think overall, you know, coming into the preseason, our goal was just to build on what we did last year. You know, we had a lot of injuries early on, especially at the defensive end of the field, and to get some guys back, to get a little more co cohesiveness on that end of the field. But having all that, having Dom DePazzi back and Dylan Harris and Joey Cannon all back into the lineup really helps us in returning our scarred and goalkeeper. So that helps us and only get better in offense and we return. A uh, bunch of our best offensive players, so I think to improve there. So I think our culture and everything's gotten a lot better. So those are kind of the goals we wanted to kind of build on leading into the preseason as we build up to your signings. Well, just to get back so many guys that we've had in the offensive end. You know, last year we had to kind of move some guys around, especially Ethan Christensen, who played uh, attack so much for us last year. Now he's going to move back to the midfield and team up with Gray McKee and a freshman and Cam Leidig, who had such a great. Uh, a great uh, time at um, DeMatha High School, but just to get JT back, Thielen, who's a 99 point scorer in the MAC Commonwealth Off uh, Offensive Player of the Year, and they have Jacob Tatum, who had such a great freshman year uh, for us to come back, and Jacob's bigger, faster, stronger, and has been so well. But to add into the mix of him, Connor Nelson, who's a kid who transferred in from Syracuse, is going to help us there. But, um, but Will, uh, Will Smith, who's a kid who transferred in from Howard Community College, is a very talented kid. We think he's probably going to start in there. Another lefty for us who's just so crafty around the goal. So we really have some guys that can really do a lot of things um, for us on the offensive end. And, and with so many lefties in our lineup now, we're kind of make us very unusual compared to other lineups in the offensive end. So we're excited about it. And we just got to keep growing and getting better. And I think we've adopted to the new rules of the shot clock and everything. I think that's really helped the way we play and uh, how we go about our, 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 the way, our style of play. I should say. Well, I think the biggest thing that's about the team is that the culture they built. You know, our guys have really bought into the weight room now and all the little things off the field for them to develop, and our culture has gotten so much better over the last three years. Not that it was bad before, but they just improved on that, and the leadership that we've had and the senior leadership we have is so great that these guys want to win. Or, you know, they've done such a great job uh, on the field and doing everything so far. The preseason's been awesome, so we're just hoping that translates to on-the-field success as well.